So here's what we're going to do. We're going to take a very popular soft drink and the reason that we use this clear Sprite is that so that way you can see the reaction that we're going to have with this pH testing solution. Okay? So what we're going to do is we're going to pour some Sprite in here as so. And the next thing we're going to do is we're going to take also a very popular soft drink and again we use a clear liquid so that way you can see what, how this thing tests out. The next thing we're going to do is we're going to take a product that Coca-Cola makes. This is a reverse osmosis water and you'll want to pay attention to what happens as we test this water. And alongside Dasani is its counterpart made by Pepsi, which is Aquafina. Again, this is a reverse osmosis water. And we're not here to just pick on Aquafina or, or, or Dasani. This actually applies to any reverse osmosis water. Right next to it, we've got our Kangen water, which is the 9.5. And this is the water that we're going to be drinking. And over here on the end is the tap water here. Okay. So now what we're going to do is we're going to take this pH testing solution and we're going to put four drops in each of these liquids and what we're looking to do is match some colors here. Okay. And again, we want to be on the alkaline side meaning that we're looking for a dark blue or a purple color instead of an orange or a yellow. So let's just go ahead and see what happens. So we're going to put four drops in each. Here we go. One, two, three, and four. One, two, three, four. And now let's just go ahead and give each of these a stir and let's just look and see what happens. And here's our Sprite, here's our Gatorade, here's Dasani, here's Aquafina, here's the Kangen water, and here's your tap water. Now as you can see, the Sprite and the, Dasan and the Gatorade, rather, they're on the orange side and this is pretty much as acidic as you can get. Alongside of it are Dasani and Aquafina, your reverse osmosis waters, and as we can see here, they're also yellow, meaning that they are acidic. The reason that they're acidic is reverse osmosis water actually pulls out everything out of the water, including the minerals. And when you don't have minerals in the water, you're going to get an acidic water. As a matter of fact, the Japanese refer to reverse osmosis water as dead water. And along here, you can see our Kangen water, and it's not because of the bottle here. As you can see, it's the bright purple that we're looking for, and this is the 9.5. This is what you're looking for. This is what you want to hydrate your body with. And right now, Next to it is your tap water and by federal mandates most municipal waters are on the neutral side but before you get too excited keep in mind they use lye which is something that's very caustic to bring the water from a very acidic state to a neutral state. 